Hey folks, just letting you know that I've got art commissions open. More info will be in the description, and I hope you enjoy the video. I, uh, I think things got a little heavy last time. So, neither of you knew Safina had a sister? She never mentioned me? Even once? Maybe she's embarrassed by me. The date on the book, it's marked 833. So it was published, what, 300 years from now? Ridiculous. Either that, or it completely predates our calendar system. Alright. Oh, since we're here, actually. Not you. Figure out the rest later. <laughs> I'm not approaching that bird. I refuse. Bogey blob. It's like the boogeyman, but it's a blob. I get it. Dark cell key. Are you kidding me? Oh. Okay, you know what? Sure, you can have it. <laughs> Oh, okay then. Brimshot. M Marie! I I'm okay now. The pun hurt more than anything else. I don't know, I guess maybe like 50, 60 pounds? Maybe, uh, oh, uh, anyway, back to this. Uh, see her. Nah, I'm gonna hold off until... Until we get more gems. Ah. Love this place. Now, I think... Do I need to be wearing it? Don't necessarily want to, but... Seal shimmers slightly, but... Is not quite convinced. Wait, so... Oh, maybe the- oh, okay. My bad. I need to go back to- Wait, they even said, okay, let's go back to the library, and I'm just like, alright! <laughs> to the dormitories! Uh, I frustrate myself. Okay, let's see what we can do. Uh, excuse me? A kitten. It's the same one from before. It attacked us outside its half's room. Quick, let's catch it before it gets away. Alright, you got it. Hello? Maxim. That is an un... Interesting haircut. What am I doing? <laughs> what a ridiculous question. What else would I be doing? I'm reading about sharks! I'm a big fan of sharks. Probably the biggest, to be honest. I'd be surprised if anyone knew as much about sharks as me. Alright. You do you, boo. What in the... Are we... Are we just not gonna address... Oh, that's a living book. <laughs> Look at those googly eyes. What do we got here? Horror. Not too much horror going on here. Maybe existential horror. You'll poke someone's eyes out. Well, I hope not. You kinda need his eyes. Alright, there we go. Jeez. Oh. Nice, gotta level up. Ah, shoot. But this is a sign, though. But it's very clearly a sign. Why can't I read it? Alright. Alright, let's, let's fight you. Oh, that ain't horror. What are you? Common coin. Well, that'll help pay for the stuff we need. I guess. Hold on. 
thriller. <laughs> okay, no, I shouldn't be doing that. <laughs> Copyright on that. Plot twist. It's not actually copyright. No, I don't know. Ah, oh, come on, you can't have two plot t twists in a row. I mean, I guess you can, it's just... why? <laughs> nice, we're all level 8. Alright, hold on. Okay. Nope, we're not fighting you again. Oh boy. Alright. Uh, yeah, I figured. Okay, let's go. Oh, good, I get to fight both of you now. Alright, cool, 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 cool. Took a lot longer than it probably should have. Uh, okay, there we go. What? I didn't know about this place. I guess most people didn't. Oh! Uh, hi! In the mirror, it's... Purdy? <laughs> Immediately my mind is like, boy, she do look purdy. <laughs> I hit myself. <laughs> uh. How observant of you, Rook. And the cat that stole the book! I stole the book! I am the cat! I thought the mystery solving gang would have figured that out already! So, do we call you Perticia now? Haha, -ha, yes, very funny. Please, joke at my expense. She's the one from the memory in the schoolyard. Marie, this is Perticia. <laughs> of the illustrious Abednego family. She likes to stick her nose in our business all the time. If your business didn't put folks in danger, maybe I wouldn't. You're blowing things way out of proportion. Again. She doesn't like us very much. Oh, don't give yourself so much credit. It's this one's sister who I have a problem with. I don't care who she's pretending to be friends with this week. What's that supposed to mean? Um, so I guess I'll ask the question then. Why are you inside a mirror down here? And why did you steal the book? Talk to the cat, I can't see through my body right now. And I'm trapped in the mirror because Safina stuck me here. She can do that? It's these books she keeps finding, full of old spells, runes. I don't know where she's getting them from. Is... Is that why the headmistress took her? No. No. The headmistress was in a complete panic when I saw her last. Safina found something old. Something dangerous. She said if Safina uses it, the entire school would be utterly destroyed. D destroyed? <laughs> oh look, the mystery solving gang didn't figure this one out. Saf wouldn't destroy the school. She's not dangerous. She's not dangerous? I'm literally the magic mirror! <sighs> I 
Do I need to remind you how many times you three saved... You three have saved Ekenfell? From the disaster she caused? And right now, you're talking to a cat because... Safina trapped my body in a mirror... In a secret basement. So don't you dare tell me that Safina isn't dangerous. Oh, right. Marie, correct? Do me a favor. Smash this mirror and get me out of here. We need to stop your sister before she destroys this entire place. Do we even know if we can trust her? Purdy's had it out for us from the beginning. And she's obsessed with Saf. This might be a... This might all be some kind of weird ploy. I'm trapped in an adorable kitten! This has Safina's name written all over it, and you all know it! Th that doesn't sound like her. Do you know where Safina is, Perticia? No. But you'll need another piece of her clothing to find her. And I know where to find it. And what's it, exactly? It's her cloak! That ragged, floppy piece of work she wears. You know it? Matches that ugly hat you already found? I know where it is, and I won't tell you squat until you let me out. I'm not seeing much of a choice. I think we should let her out. I'm still not sure about this. We need that cloak. And she's our best shot right now. If she causes trouble, there are three of us. So I just... smash it, then? Please! I can't stand another minute in this body! Here goes nothing. Ah! Glass in everyone's eyes! Hey there, sweetie. Sorry for taking over your body for so long. Is that your cat? This is Snowball. She is perfect in every way. I didn't know you had a cat at the school. That was by design. I didn't think I was able to spy on you all so easily all the time. That explains a lot. Alright, you're obviously the new leader of this trio. If you want the cloak, we have to get to the northern dorms. There are more dorms? It's the fancy dorms, where the rich, where the rich families get to stay. It's a blue building past the alchemy labs. I can get us inside once we get there. But let me get this straight. I'm not your friend. And I'm not on your team. You want to find Saf? You want to find Saf, and I want to stop her before she kills everybody. So let's get moving. The sooner we get this over with, the better. Cecilia joins the party. Sort of. I guess so. Oh, hold on, I gotta heal. Only three characters can be in your party at a time. You can switch who is in your current party at, a, at any cat saves. Makes sense. Yeah, I guess it makes sense that Rook isn't on the team right now. Well... No, you know what? Hold on. Yeah, Petronella's been on the team the longest. Also, shouldn't we grab that book? I guess not. 
Oh, hey, another tree. Frick yeah. Uh, I guess Sigbert's still dealing with the vines. Gotcha, bitch! Or not. Hey, bud. You need anything? Uh... Do I? Particia whispers something. Subscribe to Mikhail Shion. Okay, let's go. You got it. Alchemical lights? This is Olo's... Olo's advanced runes. And here, Vega's final... Treaties? Treaties? Wow, oh, okay, this is really testing my vocabulary. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not smart. <laughs> I've been trying to get my hands on this for months. But these books don't even look like they've been touched. To be honest with you, these books are just for show. Super nerds like Rook here spend all their time in the library. Or locked up in their room. Or locked up with their own books in their rooms. <laughs> Sounds like a great weekend to me. It feels so weird being in the blue dorms. I don't think I've ever set foot in here before. That actually raises, raises a good question. Why would Saf's cloak be in here of all places? It's not. The Snatcher took it. The Snatcher? Um, can someone fill me in? Misplaced keys? Can't find your glasses? Or your left sock is gone? And your hair ties keep vanishing? Might be the Snatcher. An ancient creature and, prof and prolific thief. You know, some people have even seen it. A fleshy arm comes right through the floorboards, and it snatches away your things. I've read of similar accounts. It was a snatcher who stole Saf's cloak. She created a passage through the unseen to get to its lair. Just like your secret passage out of the school. Yeah, I know about that too. Where's the passage? Why is it here? It's in my family's storage locker. It was... the best access point available. So Saf... used my room without asking. As she does. I doubt she's telling us the whole story. Hmm. Okay, so where's the locker? It's at the east end of the building, near the bathrooms. I'll open it once we get there. Alright, you got it. What is that? Oh. Uh. Uh. Oh. Bury it. Barrelois? Did they even pronounce that correctly? Hold on. Barrelos. I'll assume it's something like Barrelos. Because it's like barrel, because it's a crystal, but I don't know, whatever. Well, anyway, time to die. Oh. Right, she's not technically part of the party, so... Ouch. 
common coin. What? What are you doing? Do none of you know any protection spells? How have you survived up to now? Oh. Uh. Oh. Uh, cool. Thanks, Pratisia. <laughs> Alright, neat. I do appreciate that everyone still gains experience. Giselle Burt's family room. Interesting. Oh, wait, hold on. I hear that. Oh. <gasps> Sparkly gem! How many did that one person want? Like, I want to say it was seven, but I'm not sure. It's just a brick wall. So it looks like there should be a door. Ah, shortcut. I see. Toilets are not appropriate vessels for summoning sea spirits. <laughs> Please use the summoning pools provided in the spirit oval. Well, I do appreciate that they're not trying to, like, completely hinder people. Or students. So is there nothing here? Well, Alright then. The door's locked, but the lock itself seems to have no mechanism. Ugh, of course the password changed. It's designated to automatically change once a week. You have to get the new password for my room. Alright then. Which of these is your room? That's a lot of cats. Hello. Everyone in Eakenfell is all about cats. But I prefer my little familiars. Mice? Rats? Now that's where it's at. They're small, stealthy, can sneak into all kinds of places. And best of all, they've got big ears. Good for listening, if you know what I mean. Wait, you didn't let me finish. Some witches make a living off potions, conjuration, you name it. But us? No. We've learned that information is what people want. I happen to have some pretty hot goss. I mean, information. What do you say? For 50 gold, I'll give you the latest and greatest. Sure, why not? Now we're talking. What do you want to know? Guild the secret clutch effect. I already know the clutch effect. The all cat, mirror of echoes, ravenous book. Well, what the hell is the all cat? Have you visited the next room yet? Notice the wall with a big cat face? Kind of hard to miss. That used to be my room, but it made my little babies nervous. There have been whispers of the elusive creature called the All-Cat. Adventurers, heroes, sailors, and scholars speak of it. But only ever in quiet tones, not to be overheard. Unless you have adorable little spies with big ears, of course. I think these doors have something to do with the All-Cat. I bet that if you wanted to meet it, the key lies beyond them. If only we had some way to make them open. Alright. Uh... Mirror of Echoes. One of my little familiars was snooping around the school once. They stumbled onto a... on a secret room with a big mirror inside. But... something happened. The poor thing is traumatized by whatever they saw in that mirror. They won't speak a word of it, and I don't want to push the matter. I've asked around, and nobody has heard 
of such a room. Except Gwenora, who I'm sure knows something about it. But you know Gwenora. She dodged the question and mocked me a bunch. I couldn't squeeze any info out of her. But maybe you'll have more luck. Alright. Uh, sure. Tell me Gilda's secret. My little ones have been scouting around lately, as usual. That Gilda girl picked up some new powers, hasn't she? But they've been watching her, and noticed something... odd. At the start of a fight, she's all tough and flashy, big explosions. But after she gets a few hits... But after she gets hit a few times, she really loses confidence. Her hits lose their oomph. That is good information. And I feel like it's going to be relevant soon. Ravenous book. Ravenous book. My little ones told me about something they found in the library once. An old book. Like, real old. Every student knows to be careful around old books. Especially abandoned ones. They tend to... bite. Or chase you around. Or spit acid at you. But this one was different. It... talked. They said it had a horrible demonic voice, and beckoned to them. Oh, the curiosity. It was all they could... It was all they could to not open. It was all they could to not... to open it and peer inside. I feel like that's a typo. But my little mice have a good sense of smell, and they smell the trap. Still, I wonder what became of that creepy old tome. That would be good to know. Uh, could, uh yeah, okay. Well then. Oh, yeah, doors like this. Cat door opens its mouth. And you're not sure what it wants. There's gotta be something I can do with that. Oh well. <sighs> I just can't get it right. Why do I even bother? Oh! Sorry, I didn't hear you enter. Don't mind me, just muttering to myself as usual. Okay, these guys aren't happy. Uh... Do you have anything to say? I've been... I've been procra... Hold on. <laughs> uh, fumbling myself. <clears throat> I've been practicing summoning since first year, but all I've ever managed to call on is these little grums. I'm sorry, they're called grums? That's kind of cute, actually. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, they're cool little folks once you get to know them, but I just wish I could do more. Now I'm a... Z's a real summoner. I can never dream of being as powerful as Z is. But, hey, I guess that goes to show that having a rich family isn't everything. Fair enough. I'm a... Why does that sound familiar? Oh! Hi. You like this? It's snow! Usually only get snow really far up north. But since that's... But since that big energy surge, I've been able to conjure it even here. Though, for some reason, my snowflakes are... Cubes. Pretty sure snow doesn't fall in cubes. It's still pretty, though. Fair enough. Alright. Oh, wait. Wait, hold on. 
Okay, so I think I've mentioned before that I played a bit of this, but didn't really get to finish it. I am vaguely remembering what happens here. Also, I see an outline for a door up here. Oh, yep, there it is. Alright. Well. <laughs> okay, this is my room. If you touch anything, the raven herself won't find your remains. Ooh. Surprise! Oh no. Er, my leg is stuck. Er. <laughs> Gilda? I'm okay! <laughs> In fact, I'm feeling great! Hey! Where's the cute one? Did you find out where Safina is, Gilda? Safina? I'm not looking for Safina. I'm looking for you! <laughs> uh, oh. Well, you found me. Yikes! She's even cuter, of course. I am so gay. Oh, Gilda, sweetheart. I understand so much. <laughs> Look at her. Oh, right. I want a rematch. But this time, I want to be alone with you. I mean, the two of us together, with magic. I, I, I mean, a duel. <laughs> God, she is so helplessly gay, and I love her so much for that. <laughs> Marie? A one-on-one, -on -one, huh? Fine, I'll duel you. Because this is obviously important to you. But why? Yes! You beat me, I'll tell you. You got this, Marie. We'll be cheering you on. Let's go. Fire versus lightning. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't want to. I, I don't want to just be singing through this whole fight. <laughs> I'm just ah, it's so good. Love the music. Love. Oh god. Love her character. Love everything about this. Okay. Um. All right. I'm gonna have to take this seriously. Ooh, the timing on that. Hold on, does that mean that I have plus seven now? It'd be awesome if that's the case. Oof! Alright, I don't think that's plus seven. I think the plus four overwrites my plus three, but... And I think because of the item, it's probably a bad idea to, uh... Try and try and use the power up item, so. Alright, you. Let's try this. I'm a little frustrated that she's not hurt by her. She doesn't seem to be hurt by her own traps. Despite the fact that we very much are. There we go! 
Oh, she's so grumpy. Rare gem. All right, cool. Cool, cool, cool. I, I lost. Again. I just don't get it. I wanted to fight you because you've got new powers just like me. And I've been working so hard and I... But I... But I still just suck. I suck! Kilda, that's... Leave me alone! I'm just trash compared to you. Always have been. Always will be. Kilda. Uh, 